Welcome back to another video of Activeverse Universe today. We're gonna have a banger, bang, man! I appreciate everybody that followed almost a 10k subscribers. Somebody said I'm gonna hit 10k next year. By next year, come on, man! We came a long way, man. Everybody that supported. Thank you, man. Everybody that sent me the notification gang on Instagram, I made sure I shout you guys out ASAP. So appreciate everybody that did that for this video. Actually, I'll be doing it till I hit 10K. Anybody that's notification gang, post notification gang in the comments. I'm posting you. Send me a DM on the Instagram and I'm gonna post you, shout you out. And I'm gonna check out your address also. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate everybody, man. But today I got a banger. Banger, banger, banger video. Let's get into it. Before we get into it though, hey, you know what that is? You know what that is? Intro! Intro! Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Oh, I Alright guys, I have a new intro also coming out for the 10k. Besides that, I'm going to be dyeing my hair. Since I've been doing a lot of stuff with my hair, recently I congo my hair. Some hair got attached with each other and so I let them grow like that. And now what I'm doing is I'm going to be recounting my dreads again. I have done this video before a long time ago, very long time ago. For the day ones, still, if you're just now seeing this, you're still a day one. You can be a day one, man. I think till you hit like 10k, maybe 20, 50. I think everybody could consider it uh, day ones because how far we gonna go after that we going we shooting for like 1 million and stuff like that you get what i'm saying so hey make sure you guys subscribe i have a bunch of cars behind me passing by so if that's bothering you guys just forget about it because concentrate on this video and on the little music background that i have and enjoy this video i'm gonna be counting my dreads like i said it's been a while since I counted my dreads. Thank you everybody that checked out the last video where I dropped my hair down for 24 hours, man. I don't do that, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people been saying, you get you get all your hair tangled up because you have your hair up like that, man. You need to get your hair down. And I'm like, you're right. You know what I'm saying? You're right, I can't lie, you're right, but at the same time, I don't like my hair down, man. I don't like my hair. I wish I put my hair down when I started my dreadlock. Because I went back and looked at some videos and I was like, dang, my dreads were like so dope to just rock down, man. They look good on, like down, but I always had it on ponytail. I, I guess I don't get the luxury of it. That's probably why. But I'm going to start doing, trying to put my hair down more. I know sometimes I put some like hair down like this and tie it in the back. Have it in the back and stuff like that. I need to enjoy my dreads, man. I need to at least once a week let them down. Or after I wash them, just like, you know, let it dry out like this. As I've been telling you guys, actually, I'm going to be, I'm going to be, you know, redoing this whole set of lineup that I used to do. I used to cut my hair down like this. I know a lot of people are doing it right now. You cut your hair down like this and get a lineup. It's pretty cool, but not cool when once everything is grown and you start seeing your hairline going back. You know what I'm saying? Kind of sucks having a big forehead. But big forehead gang. No, hey, on my merch, I'm gonna put big forehead gang, man. I actually thought about that. I was like, I should put big forehead gang for my big forehead family. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody's big forehead, and that's not why you subscribe, but a lot of y'all do got big forehead, if not five or six or seven, ten hit, fifteen. Some of y'all, some of y'all don't even got a hair, but y'all should subscribe. I appreciate that. But hey, let me count my dreads. Enjoy this video. Make sure you hit the thumbs up, comment, share. Instagram, check me out, DM me, let's get to it, man. Big family gang gang. I'm gonna be using this for every hair I tie. I'm gonna just put it in in, the, in, in here or something. I don't know how else I would count it. I, I, actually, I'm gonna just keep it in the back. I'm gonna take out one by one. I'm gonna put it in the ponytail, and I'm probably gonna fast forward this moment right here till I get to like I don't know. I might show you guys, or if I talk, I might just leave it like that. All right, that's one, two, three. Forty-nine, fifty, fifty-one, 
52. 52. You know, I have pretty thick dreads, and that makes sense why I have 53, uh, 52. I used to have 54, and I had two sets of Congo now. One of them got congo up because I wanted I wanted to connect my dreads, and I, that, there's a video of that. Actually, I'm probably put it right here, and and it was because the bottom, like the roots, were very thin. It's kind of getting me sketchy. What I don't like is when my hair gets very thin on the roots. Kind of sketches me out. For a lot of people, they already have skinny dreads, so they're kind of used to it. But mine. I don't get it professionally locked, so I don't put a lot of stress on the retwist. So if it just like randomly starts to get skinny, I'm like, what's going on there? You know what I'm saying? I haven't done much research to learn about it. I should probably do that. But yeah, I locked those up together, and then I have one set of Congo also that I locked in together because I didn't retwist it for a while. So it got locked up together, and it ended up being two sets of dread or one set of Congo. So that's why I have 52. I used to have 54. If you have thicker dreads than me, you probably we have less 30s maybe you know what I'm saying I think the regular count is very thick dreads is 30 to 33 uh, medium size which is mine would be I would say 50 to 55 and then if you have skinny 70s and over uh, so that's how you know if you have a medium size of dreads, very thin size of dreads, and very thick dreads. At the end of the day, I think the medium one is the one I prefer. You can prefer anything. It has There's nothing wrong with it. You can want my sets of locks, but you have to be proud of yours also. And also, soon I'm going to be doing a, a way to start your dread channel, which I have been uh, doing for a year and I've had a good, great amount of success. Uh, shout out to everybody. Shout out to Gun the Great that put me on here. Uh, Donate the Great uh, or Donate Daily also. Uh, and a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, that supported. Not just to mention the big family, but also everybody that comments. I see a lot of people and I can just name it off the top of my head. You know what I'm saying? Because I read your comments and I make sure I reply. But I will show you guys how to start your own dread journey. And who cares sometimes people don't subscribe. You can look at it and see how much you came, how far you came. And for me, to, like, till I saw the old videos that I posted, I didn't really think how far, like, I didn't really think of, like, how much progression I've had. Don't be disappointed in your progression. Just start logging it, just vlogging it, start logging it every day or every month, or it could be every six quarterly of the year, and start looking at it in the future and start, I don't know, your dread channel. Who knows? Like, who knows where you're gonna be at, man? A lot of people, especially my young fans, y'all don't think y'all can do it because y'all don't have money, y'all don't have equipment, lights, and stuff like that. But to be honest with you, you guys don't need none of that. I know people that started their YouTube channel off a of phone, off an of Android phone. Android. Not to bag on the Android, but hey, I used to have an Android. Nothing wrong with it. I came to Apple side and never went back. When she go to Apple, you never go. So don't be scared to do that. And I'm gonna drop a whole video on how I started my Dread channel and also what equipment that I use. But yeah, I do have 54 or 52 Dreads. Yeah, 52? Yeah, 52 Dreadlocks. And you know what I'm saying? And I might as well give you out the 17 months up day. You know what I'm saying? And today is like May, I don't know, the middle of May, May 11th, I think. I started my Dread journey the year 2018, the end of 2018, like I said and the beginning of 2019 marks some first month and so till now it's been 17 months of dread lock and you know i came so far and a lot of you guys look at my dreads and be like oh your hair grows much fast and it, it can and i think it does a little bit more than other people maybe but at the same time i started with a longer hair when i started my dread i had pretty long hair like up to here or so maybe here and when i locked it up it shrunk like halfway <laughs> that's what happens whenever you have when you get dreads that's why i don't recommend people to have six inches or less to start dreads just wait a little bit but i've had this for yeah 17 months it's looking amazing you know what i'm saying like I have no complaint about my dreads. I love them. They're amazing. They smell good because I rinse them. ACV rinse. Check out that videos that I've been doing ACV rinse and I can do another one. I've had one set of color so far and that was like not even a color. It's like bleaching my hair. I bleached one side of my hair and I'm going to do another set of color really soon and I'm very excited for that to show you guys with the dreadlocks with the blue. Oh, it's going to look so good with the light on too. You know it. You know it. Man, make sure you subscribe for that because I'm gonna be dropping it real soon. I'm about to hit 10k real soon, so stay tuned for that notification gang. Where y'all at? Man, thank you for it.
you know what I'm saying, for checking out this video. Journey, update, no more freeform. And I thought about freeforming also the rest of my journey. Let me know what you guys think about that in the comments. But till next time, keep acting diverse and creating your universe. I'm out.